Got to talk and I'm hip dip. And this is a Toshiba all in one PC with which is 23 inch. I see touch screen. Says the specs there, um, 799 pounds. That's probably a basic model, I guess. So, what does it have inside? An Intel Core i3 Fed Gen, um, memory, 4 gig, one terabyte about hard drive, and graphics. Integrated graphics, it says, I guess. Windows 8 built in camera, which is up there. But yeah, you can see it. Um, USB ports somewhere, if I can find it. Um, wi Fi enabled, obviously, because you need internet and um, a DVD writer. Uh, so let's just check, check, test out the touchscreen. Well, as you can see, there's not that much stuff put on the um, screen. So let's see. You can move tiles around, which is like, um, let's press this. Okay. Oh, it's not. See this? That's how you can move it to other places, go back. Um, oh, uh, if you want to make more room for your apps, swipe down. Um, to show this in a smaller view, which means you can put loads of apps on. Let's make it bigger again. Um, see, to come up with your um, search, share, start, which goes to this homepage. Devices, I don't know, that's and settings. Let's go back there. Let's go up. Well, obviously, what I've shown on the laptops, apps, shows all your apps. Um, some tough Shiba stuff put on command prompts, everything. Let's go back home. Uh, let's see, camera. So, oh, say hi to me, yay. Oh, you can see my face, but yeah, I look awesome. Uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. Um, that's how you exit it. Um, let's see, let's check messaging. So I clicked on messaging, logo come up. Oh look, and you can type new messaging, etc, etc. Look how cool it is. Looks awesome. You can connect to your Facebook, MSN, etc. Let's quit that. No. Oh. That's quit. Uh, I don't know what that was. I think it was a notification. That, um, I got a message, might be. So let's check out news. I'm testing out the news. Oh wait, no, fitness class notification. Don't know. There's no internet. Okay, I'm gonna have to exit this. Um, games. As it says, there's no internet. I think. Oh wait, yeah, no internet. Xbox games. That just means your PC games, really. So you can't go on the internet. There's nothing much really on this. To be honest, Xbox, Xbox, Microsoft Office. Let's test that out. Uh, um, oh, okay, I, I can't use that. Uh, but what I've shown is it goes back to um, desktop mode, which I forgot to. Oh wait, wait a sec. Let's pull this down. Exit. Oh, so uh, how do you go to the desktop? Desktop's here. Sister G, but for some reason I don't get. But yeah, this is your normal screen that you would get on a Windows 7. A different way. Oh, Internet Explorer. What? Oh, wait, it's not connected to the internet. Sorry about the dodgy camera view. Um, that's it, really. There's nothing much. Let's go in there. Oh, no. Cause the start menu has been. Oh, yeah, I get it now. The start menu is. The Metro UI. Whoops. So let's exit this. Oh, as you know, you get installed with this as an Internet Explorer number 10, which is not reliable. But obviously, it's a good PC, I guess. You get a keyboard, which build quality is nice. Let's go exit this. The build quite is nice, I guess. Mouse Toshiba. 
Uh, this is Gadget Talk and I'm here with you.